Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So I've already kind of got a, me a mess going. So I have these, um, these, let me show you if I have any out. I don't think I have, I have these wooden uh, coasters that I have ordered. And then I have the, uh, the cork backs that are gonna go on them once I finish them. So, so what I did first, my first step I did off camera, which I used a, uh, it's the Folk Art uh, acrylic paint, and I painted them in a um, brushed black. So it's kind of a, uh, got a little bit of an iridescent look to it. So I, I brushed them, gave them two coats, and on the edges, I gave them coats. And then what I'm going to do is, I have a stamp that I am, it's like a flower stamp, and I'm using um, a peony pink mica powder. And I'm going to put the mica powder onto the stamp, and then I'm stamping, I did this one here. And then I'm gonna stamp them take it off of this to stamp it so it'll I can put some pressure so we're gonna stamp them and then what I'm gonna do is use my uh, resin and finish them off with some resin and I may put just a little bit of uh, glitter in the center of the flower with the resin so there's the second one and this is kind of also a little bit of an iridescent pink. So let me get the stamps on all of them. And then I will mix my, my resin and maybe a little bit of glitter for the centers. on there as I wanted to. Got a little spot right there. And I'm not sure how the um, how the I don't know if I can go over that without it looking like I've doubled it up. How the resin or the um, mica powder will take to the resin if it doesn't disappear it off of there. Give it a little bit of a 3D effect, but that won't matter. They all kind of have that look to them. So, so I'm going to do one more. my resin and um, I will put the resin on there to seal those so we're gonna see how that's gonna go so I will be back shortly and just so you can kind of get a close-up of how those are looking on the on the coasters even now I'll be back shortly. Okay guys, I'm back and I have mixed my resin 
and I used this uh, rose gold glitter to make my little centers and I did that with uh, UV resin and just put that under the UV lamp to uh, to get that to cure really quickly so we're gonna start with this and see how this goes I hope it doesn't run all over the edges I'm hoping it'll stay within the coaster so we're just gonna pour a little bit at a time oh my lord Mark it out to the edges. I hope it doesn't dissipate my flower. We'll see.
Okay guys, I'm gonna let this dry overnight and then we'll see tomorrow because I'll have to put a little bit of resin on the edges. I've got a little bit of resin left over so I'm gonna make something else. But we've got to put some resin around the edges and see how it goes. I'm gonna have to keep working with this because it's kind of pulling away from the edges. But hopefully within the next 30 minutes or so it'll start to set and it will it will be okay. I feel like I lost a little bit of this flower right here, but the rest, rest of them look pretty good. And we will see tomorrow how it really finished off. So I will see y'all tomorrow. Here is the finished product. Put the resin on them. I put little pink centers. I'm trying to keep the light from, from hitting them. I put the, uh, the cork backs on them. If you did like this video, if you give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel so you'll be able to hit that little drop down box and know when I put up my next video. And I thank you for watching my channel.